all of Aubrey O'Day's comments regarding Sean Diddy Combs and 10 images in the documentary TMZ Presence, The Downfall of Diddy, Aubrey O'Day asserted that Sean Diddy Combs attempted to buy her silence by giving Bad Boy Records the publishing rights. The publishing deal arrived. I am aware of its contents. In the documentary, O'Day stated, I know how much money it was giving me. She continued, I think you would probably be making moves to keep as many people quiet as possible. O'Day began her professional life as a member of the girl group Danity Kane, for which Combs served as a mentor. She spoke candidly about the troubled rap mogul's actions in an interview with Variety decades after the show concluded. Puff is a really challenging individual to work with, revealed O'Day. Everything needed to be flawless. He once commented, What is your third toenail doing? After examining my toenails, make sure you get that S fixed before entering a room. Or he would come in for five minutes with a camera and ask, Aubrey, why are you sweating? While we were rehearsing an hour and a half repeatedly, you appear to be a soggy dog. Do you think anyone wants to see that since you're the attractive one? When Combs was around, the 40-year-old singer of Damaged recalled feeling scared to death because there was no margin for error. In addition to professional problems, she allegedly encountered sexism and racist remarks while filming the MTV series. O'Day wasn't afraid to express her opinions on her Instagram story, even though not many people left comments regarding Homeland Security's raids into Combs' properties. O'Day wrote, What you sow, you shall reap. I hope this gives all U.S. victims the confidence to finally talk about what we have gone through. On this one, too late is the better term than too soon.